One of my most searched articles is how to accept an award. Assuming that one day you might have to do the same, here is my bottom line advice. You won't have long. Get to the point fast. This is about you and your relationship with the organization who gave you the award. Be aware of self-deprecating humor. One gentleman I was coaching was receiving the Member of the Year Award. He was getting it from his organization with over 100,000 members. 2,000 people would be in the audience. He said, I want to be funny, so I'll start by saying how desperate they must be to give me this award. Naturally, I told him, no, this would be an insult to every winner who came before you and who will follow you. Also, those who wish they'd beat you out and won the award themselves. Another client was being honored for his success in the construction industry by Chico State University. They were celebrating the impact of their construction management course, and my client had been in their very first ever course. His opening was, what a privilege to be considered part of the success of Chico's construction management courses. He talked about the amazing clients he had because of what he had learned. After the other five honorees, his wife, his number one biggest critic, leaned over and whispered, you can tell the others didn't work with a speech coach. Good investment. As you prepare for your three, five or seven minute masterpiece, consider who nominated you who invite you to, to join this group or encourage you to get involved with this project or event? What is your connection to this group? How do you feel about the people and the organization's goals? Why are they giving you this award? When was the first time you attended a meeting or what have been your experiences? Have you seen anybody else accept this same award? People will not remember all the details of what you say. They will remember the stories you tell. Include a memorable vignette or incident, something entertaining or touching about your connection. The Oscars have very few memorable examples of great acceptance speeches. When Russell Crowe won an Oscar for The Gladiator 2000, he dedicated it to everyone who has seen the downside of disadvantage. When he got the 2002 Golden Globe Award for A Beautiful Mind, first he gave credit to the characters in the film, offering special thanks to John and Alicia Nash for living such an inspirational love story. He added, A Beautiful Mind is just a movie, folks but hopefully it will help us open our hearts to believe that something extraordinary can always happen in our lives. Here are a few more great opening lines from Oscar acceptance speeches. Hilary Swank, Best Actress, Million Dollar Baby 2004. I'm just a girl from a trailer park who had a dream. I never thought this would ever happen. Meryl Streep, Best Actress, The Iron Lady 2012. When they called my name, I had this feeling I could hear half of America going, oh no, come on, her again. And the late, much loved Robin Williams, Best Supporting Actor, Goodwill Hunting, 1998. Most of all, I want to thank my father up there, the man when I said I wanted to be an actor. He said, Wonderful. Just have a backup profession, like welding. I hope you enjoyed this article as much as I enjoyed putting it together. Below, you can link on the article I mentioned. So although there aren't enough good Oscar speeches, I hope the few I mentioned gave you a chuckle or inspired you.